Hi, this is Tony Levin, and I'm looking forward to our concert on April 5th at Palais Montcalm in Quebec. Hope to see you there. This is the first time we're, we're coming to Quebec. It's going to be great. I've told them what a great city that is for music. I have played in Quebec City a lot and love it. It's one of my very favorite places to be. Uh, so there's something special about that. I think all the guys in the band are uh, uh, excited about it in some place new. And we're going to play, because we're in upstate New York, we're going to hit Montreal on the way up to Quebec. And it's going to be a very special trip for us. Also, uh, to join, rejoin with the California Guitar Trio is very special to me. We have a big history in Quebec City. We play together a lot. They've had me uh, be a guest with them. And this is the first time we've shared the bill with two different acts. And it's very, there's something very special about that. I'm sure we haven't discussed it yet, but I'm sure I'm going to sit in with them on a couple of their pieces. And that'll be really fun for us. I think it was in the, 90, in the 1990s that the California Guitar Trio guitar trio was opening act for King Crimson. I was touring with King Crimson and for about 100 shows they were the opening act. So 100 times I was standing off the side of the stage listening to them because they're great. They're a great group. And, and of course I got to know them very well. And after that tour when there was a chance when they had the right kind of tour that I could join them as a fourth person with my electric bass for just a few shows or sometimes a little tour, two week tour, then I did. We did that a lot. So I've toured with them a lot and uh, we're very good friends for a long time. And it began from them opening for King Crimson. Why they were opening for King Crimson, I think is because they had been all students of Robert Fripp. Robert Fripp is the guitarist who formed King Crimson and he had a guitar circle, a very special kind of teaching. And so they all they met in that class and that's part of how they formed the California Guitar Trio. So they have a history with King Crimson and therefore they have a history with me and it's all a, a very nice history for us. It's challenging. It's, it's sometimes it's easy, sometimes it's not so easy. And sometimes, I, I don't want to talk all day about it, but sometimes you try something like, okay, how about this King Crimson piece? Let's do it in this type of jazz way, not just a jazz way. And sometimes you try it and eventually you realize it didn't work. And sometimes we try other things. Some I've tried vocals with some of these pieces. It didn't work so well. So we try a lot. That's the good thing about a band that's really a band. You get together and rehearse and try things. And some the ones that work and, and are, are good, then you leave in the set and you keep doing those. It was just luck that I played on that album the luck on my part, uh, I played on that album so long ago, I didn't, the truth is we didn't understand what the, what an impact it would have and how important it was until later. But yes, it gave me a, a lifelong special connection with Quebec. Mm -hmm. 